everybody, Pastor Owen here. I had a chance to be able to connect with you last night. Um, glad to be able to do so again. This time it's for an object lesson that goes along with our final Bible story. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in all week long to what we're doing. Um, tonight's Bible story, I think you all have had the chance to see it already, is the story of Daniel in the lion's den. Isn't that an amazing story um, of just how someone, when they choose to pray to God, can have God hear them and have God help them? Um, when we choose to pray, what we're choosing to do is to talk to God. When we make that choice, we talk to God, our prayers go up to God, He hears our prayers, and He answers our prayers. And we just wanted to do a quick object lesson to kind of just see a neat way to think about the way our prayers go to God. So if you haven't already eaten your bag of Skittles that we asked you to save for tonight, um, you can actually try this object lesson at home. What you'll need is the bag of Skittles and you'll want to have some hot water. Make sure a parent or an adult is helping you to get hot water because we don't want anyone to uh, burn themselves or hurt themselves but um, the hot water helps. And then you arrange the Skittles on a plate. Um, I think a white plate is probably best to be able to see what we're gonna be doing. And I, you can create whatever pattern of colors you want on the plate. I tried to do um, every color and just kind of make the pattern all the way around, but you can do it however you'd like. And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna carefully pour the hot water onto the plate and you get to watch what happens. So let's see what happens here. And you gotta just give it a second, but you'll slowly start to see some kind of change happening here. And you'll see that the color is moving towards the center. It does have to take, it takes a little while, so you gotta be patient. But just think about that, as, as, as each of these little Skittles are the thoughts or the, the concerns that are in, on, in our minds and in our hearts that we want God to help us with, those are all right now in our thoughts or, or uh, in our minds and our hearts. But when we make the choice, and the water is kind of like the choice to lift them up to God, when we add our concern with the choice to pray, the color begins to move to the center. And we're going to kind of just pretend that God is at the center. He is going to hear our prayers as the prayers are lifted to him. And then he will do what he knows best to do. He'll, he'll pray. Or he'll answer our prayers in a beautiful way. Just like this is making such a beautiful pattern of color all the way around the plate. Isn't that pretty? And so grab, eventually it will fill up the entire plate. It's kind of neat to even just think about the white circle in the middle being representing the purity and the holiness of God and how before, when we, before we added the water, all of the color was confined to the Skittles, but now the color has moved closer to God. I just want you all to remember that God hears your prayers. God loves hearing your prayers. And when you pray, he will answer. And it will sometimes not, it will not always be the way, he will not always answer the way we expect him to. We always want to make sure that when we pray, we understand that we're praying for God's will to be done in our lives. But God promises to watch over us, to take care of us, and to love us. Thanks again for tuning in to Vacation Bible School this week. I'm so glad I was able to be a part of it with you, and we hope to see you soon. Bye.